video is just going to be going through the homework that I gave you last Friday, um, which is due today. I did leave it later than class time, so I won't do that in the future. I left it to the end of the day, but it's awkward then trying to post the answers. So I'll probably just do it on class time. That'll be your due kind of time and date and close it then. Anyway, right, we'll run through these. So we've been asked to simplify, which is to add together um, letters or it can be letters squared from the same family. So the first one here, I have an X and an X. They're both from the same family, which means I can add them. They have no numbers, but that's fine because we know there's an invisible one in front of them. So for part A there, it's 1X plus 1X, which is 2X. Part B, um, both X's. So again, they're both in the same family. There's an invisible one there. So it's 2 take away 1, which is 1x. Now you don't have to write the 1. We can write that. We can have that as an invisible 1, and it's just x. So either of those would be correct for b. C then, again, same family. We have 2y plus 4y. So 2 plus 4 is 6, and the family is y. Um, D then is 2a and a, so same family. Again, we have an invisible 1 here. So it's 2 plus 1, which is 3, and the family is a. E, uh, B and B, so same family, 4 and 2 is 6B. F then is same family, X and X, but we have 7 take away 3, which is 4X. Uh, G, Z and Z, uh, so same family, so we can add them, and 4 and 7 is 11. Z, um, H, so eight, uh, sorry, y and y, same family. Eight take away three is five y. Um, I then is family and family. So they're both the same. They're both x. So it's three take away three and three take away three is zero. Okay. You wouldn't write zero x simply because we know this is a multiplication. And if you multiply anything by zero, you'll get zero. Okay, so it wouldn't be correct to write 0x because you're multiplying the 0 by the x and 0 by anything is 0. And then j is 10a minus 7a. So again, same family. So just do the subtraction, which is 3a. All right, um, went down to question 3 then. So, okay. So, Family, a little bit more complicated here. We have an X and another X, and we have a Y and another Y. Okay, so if we do the X's first, we have four take away three, which is one X. And again, you can just write that as X. And then we have two minus Y, so there's an invisible one there. So it's two minus one, which is one, and the family is Y. All right, next one, uh, P, and there's another P there, and then Q, and another Q. So the P's is three take away four, which is minus one for the P family, and then two plus seven is nine for the Q family. Okay. Uh, again, P's and Q's, so there's P and there's another P and there is Q and there's another Q. So we have, in the P family, we have 7 take away 4, which is 3P. In the Q family, it's minus 6, minus, you have another invisible there, so minus 6 minus 1, that's minus 7. Okay, here we have M and another M. We have N and another N. And then we have something that has no M's or N's. So we have a constant at the end there. So the N's is minus 3 minus 4, which is minus 7 is the total for the M family. We have 2 plus 3, which is a plus 5. For the n family and then the four is all by itself so it's just plus four and then the last one in this question a's and b's so there's the a and another a and then there's b's and another set of b's okay so the a's are just eight and two so that's ten for the a family 
and the B's are minus 4 and minus 3, which is minus 7 for the B family. Um, question 4 then. Okay, so same thing again. We have an X, an X, we have a Y and a Y. And we have a constant with no letter and another constant with no letter. So the three families going on here again. So X is first is a three and a plus six, which is a plus nine for your X family. Total for Y is two and five. So that's a plus seven for your Y family. And the constants are four and nine, which is 13 in the constant family. Okay, then we have M, we have another M. We've n and another n, and again we've constant and constant. So we have um, eight for the ends. We have eight take away three, which is five m. For the ends, we have two take away two, so that's zero for the n family. And remember, you don't put the n on it, so that would just be zero. And then for the constants, we have 5 and 3, which is 8. So there's no need to write that 0, so it would be 5m plus 8 as the final answer there. Um, so 12p, and I have another, yeah, there's another p there. Uh, we have a q here and another q. And then we have a couple of constants as well. So the P family is 12 minus 12, which is zero for the P family, which we just put as a zero. Uh, Qs, we have 24 minus five, which is 19 for the Q family. Minus five minus five, that's minus 10. And again, you don't need to write that zero, so it's just 19 Q minus 10. And the last question. So, last one. First family is X squared family. So the X squared family is different from the X family. They're different. So make sure you keep them separate. And there's my X's and there's my X's. All right. So in the X squared family, we have a two and a three, which is five is the total for the X squared family. And we have a two and a five, which is seven for the X family. Um, don't know why that zoom stayed there, so we'll just move on. So B, uh, we have M squared and M squared, and we have M and M. So keep your family separate. So in the M squareds, we have three and four, which is seven for your M squared total. And then for your Ns, we have two take away three, which is minus one for your N total. And then we have Q squared, Q squared. We have Q, which is there. And then we have something here with no Qs or Q squared, so just a constant. So my Q squared is minus eight plus four. Minus eight plus four is minus four for my Q squared total. My Q is all by itself, so it'll just stay as it is. And my three or my minus three is all by itself, so it just stays as it is. All right, so that is all the answers to the homework. Um, please go through them with the answers that you sent me. Um, don't leave incorrect answers in your copy, so get out your red pen or your green pen and fix them as you would fix them in class, okay? So um, today's video for today's class will follow after this.